Hello, my friend, and welcome to my channel. Today, I've got Divine Elements Spirit. I'm going to stamp it and dot it. I've started off with Miltique's Formula 2 and Divine Elements Spirit. Beautiful silver hollow. Loving it. I've topped it with some Quick Dry from Pro FX, and I'll be stamping with Born Pretty's Hot Pink. Got my Bundle Monster Monocle Stamper and my Clear Jelly Scraper. I'll be using BM218 today. It's a French tip plate. It's been a while since I played with one of these. And I love this image. It just was talking to me. So I'm just going to line this up. And I'm kind of going a little further down because this little nail is just a little bit shorter than some of my other ones. <laughs> and we're going to do this again and again and again until all of the nails are covered. Being all lazy today, not using the tape. <laughs> Just removing that excess with my finger. But I'm going to have to break out some tape. Looky there. Pain therapy, y'all. It works. So... This is one of the longer nails, and I get a little cattywomped on it, but I'm not worried about it. The nail's kind of curvy anyway, so it's going to be just fine. And I really should play with these um, images, these French tip designs more often, because I love the look of a French tip manicure. And by using these stamping plates, you can do some really, really neat French manicures. That Divine Elements was a little sheer, so, um, uh, and I didn't want to cover it all the way up, so I thought this was the perfect solution. Just, it, they, they just work so well together. Got a little bit of cleaning up to do with the tape. And there we go. I'm going to be using Color Club's Eternal Beauty, and I'm going to do some dotting with it. This is one of the old Halo Hues. I don't remember which collection it came from. But to do my dots, I'm starting kind of in the center of the nail, right along the line of that stamped image. Just to kind of give it kind of a breaking point or a blending point. I don't know. Something like that. And my dots are not all even because I'm not a professional dotter. <laughs> but it's okay. I still think they turned out great. And believe it or not, I have worn this manicure for, let me see, four or five days. <laughs> That's kind of a record. So there we go. I'm going to let those dry, dots dry all the way down. And then I'm going to top them with some Posh Top Coat. I'm so digging this. But that Elements polish, it just had... It's got the hollow going on, but it's also got some pink and purple flash, so I thought these colors would work well for a French tip manicure. But as usual, I would like to hear what you think about this one. I've got a swatch photo coming up. Leave me a comment down below and let me know what you think about this, this hair manicure. Thanks for watching, and until next time, be good to yourself. Talk to you soon.